Tech Stock wants you to slow down and pay attention. In December, there were, there were uh, after a close call was on Mopac, police say a drunk driver going the wrong way up the highway slammed into equipment, narrowly missing the crew. Now, our Gigi Barnett is live along Mopac with more on what local law enforcement and TxDOT are doing to help keep our roads safe. Good morning, Amanda. Today, TxDOT is launching a statewide campaign. It is called Humans at Work, and the agency says it is not only for the safety of construction workers, but also for drivers. That's because last year, more than 90% of the work zone construction accidents, the, the driver was the one who was injured, not the construction worker. So last year, there were more than 25,000 crashes in work, zone, uh, work zones across the state. Those wrecks caused more than 180 80 deaths and nearly 750 injuries. Seven of those deaths were from of construction workers. The state has a law against drivers speeding, distracted, or driving drunk near roadway construction workers. And back in 2013, state lawmakers passed a law that requires drivers to either move over or slow down 20 miles below the speed limit as they approach these work zones. The agency spokeswoman says as the Austin area continues to grow, and that will lead to more roadway construction. Highway workers are eager to get this message out. They have a dangerous job working on the side of the roadway. But just as importantly, you can have a, a dangerous commute if you're not paying attention or slowing down. Where are we? We're on 183, right? And back here live off of 183, as you can see, this construction uh, in the 11 uh, counties surrounding and including Austin, there were nearly 1,500 crashes and seven fatalities last year. TxDOT fears that it will see more of these as the construction around the state continues. Back to you, Amanda. All right, thank you, Gigi. And we're seeing more and more construction zones within our city limits. And you really want to pay attention. You don't want to get caught speeding or driving dangerously in a work zone. Traffic fines double when workers are present. And you can reach up to $2,000 in fines.